Hello everyone, I'm Japanese Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Victoria 2, playing as a great power of Japan. Last time, we took out Brunei, we had a great time with them. We also took out Southern Indochina, which was great, because eventually, we're going to have a, a good time with <clears throat> Ruber. But anyways, it is time for us to come to Saigon, and uh, immediately plan <clears throat> something that one of my subscribers told me to do. Mexico looks Horrendous. Holy cow, this looks really bad. Uh, people want me to, like, colonize America. Yeah, no, no, no. I'm not that, you know, aggressive against, you know, the Americans, because they're technically, like, the third great power in the world for now. However, I don't mind attacking South America, though. I mean, they're civilized. That's cool, but, uh... Actually, how much would it take me to go to war with them? Yeah, I had to acquire a state that cost 11 infamy. <laughs> Actually, hold on. How about Puppet? That's still 10 infamy, and... We got things to do. For example, one of my subscribers, like I was trying to say, go ahead and kill off Hawaii and take it from him. And I'm thinking, you know what? Let's establish a protectorate. They might be in the American sphere for now, and maybe they'll get involved in the war. For the love of God, I hope America does not in intervene in my Hawaiian war. But you know what? Let's do it anyways. We have enough infamy that we could take a hit to it. You know, whatever. I might want to send some ships over. And we definitely need to make sure that these armies are good to go. Because they're not quite ready yet. These guys still need... A lot of artillery and infantry in this group has been hit really flipping hard. And that's okay. Let's see. You know what? I'm just going to tell half of you guys. Just give me you. Get rid of the rest of you guys. Because then we can convert them to uh, artillery. So we have 15. We need four more artillery pieces here. One, two, three, four. I can add. Great. Oh, we can make an army down here, too. That would be actually pretty good. Also, Japan. Proper. So we've got another army here. It looks pretty decent. It's not bad. It's it's okay. Where are we going to send you? I'm probably going to send you down here, which will be important. We're going to have to make another navy, too. A second fleet, of course. Not another navy. A second fleet. Oh, and before we move on, let's let, let's let time go on just a little bit. Since we need to, you know, get our justification for Hawaii going. Let's go to two-speed. And I want to talk about, like, factories. We need to build stuff in factories. That would be important. You come to Nagasaki, too. Since we do have a little bit of money... Actually, oh, we got quite a bit of money, actually. They have the Mafia down there. I don't like that. If we have grain, can I just build, like, a... Actually, what region is this called? Um, That's fish. That's grain. This is soul. Can we make a canned goods factory? We could make a canned goods factory. We got a little bit... Do we have, We've got fish... We've got grain. Do we have cattle and or steel or iron? Whatever it was. Lumber. Uh, it might be okay to build a canned good factory here. Let's build one for funsies. Because that might be good. That might not be good. We all want to keep making sure that we have a big army. So that we keep our greatest power status. And make sure we get more in industry. Not too much in the beginning. Because you don't want to make all the artisans unemployed or something like that. Because it takes a lot of resources to make sure factories are profitable. But uh, prestige is also important too. Yeah, you guys stay there, you guys stay there. You guys were hit a little bit, but you're pretty much pretty good guys. I'm a little worried about this group down here, but whatever. Actually, you got some... Oh, wait, look, you know what? They got coffee in Japanese North Borneo? I got coffee next to me right here, too. Ah, oh, I must have got it from Brunei, or what was known as Brunei. Good. Alright, so how long does this war justification take? Oh, not that long. Academic training, more morale. That seems really, really good. And actually, you know what? Um, how much of a navy? Oh, I can have way more ships. Let's, let's build another fleet. So, we're going to have another tr man of war. Oh, which ones are screens? Which ones are not screens? Frigates? Oh, this seems like it's going to cost a lot. It takes... What does that take? Uh, looks like clipper transports. It looks like, yeah... There's a huge number of them. Um, build two. No, let's have a, just a regular naval, uh, regular task force. I don't know the composition of a good task force. I'm gonna go like four, seven. Let's build that up first. Oh, who are you? Hello, Bur Burma. No, it cost some infamy, and we're twenty-ish. Whatever, that's fine. I want to go to war as fast as possible so that. America doesn't do much. 44 days. It probably takes 44 days for us to get over there. I don't think they have a massive navy. I could be wrong. So let's get over to Hawaii. Snipe that off of 
by American interests because they're partially westernized already. It's kind of like us. We got a lot of bureaucrats over there. That's not bad. Uh, oh, wow. That was really fast. Uh, maybe I should have set them a little faster, actually. Uh, well, maybe not. They're already... They're moving pretty darn quick. That's awesome. Oh, and before we move on, uh, like someone said in my comments from yesterday's video, we might have to fight Russia someday, so it's probably a good idea to keep good relations with, you know, America. Well, actually, America might not get involved. The United Kingdom. Maybe even the... Italy? You're already here? North German Confederation, of course. Or Federation. Yeah, because screw the Russians. I mean, I'm I'm pretty certain we're going to fight them. Because I want to take a lot of Manchuria, have a big old border with Russia, and just try to annihilate them as much as possible. Also, we are a great power. I can start influencing other nations like Persia. That sounds like fun. Italy, though. We already have Italy here? Oh, they're only a secondary power. How did Italy... What? How? It's only 1851. I'm mean, sure maybe I shouldn't be a great power yet, but come on, man. This, <laughs> this is weird. Yeah, this is weird. Look at that money. Uh, is militancy going up? No, it's not. Neither is that. Great. They have a single division or army there. Hopefully we can do this fairly quickly so we can snipe Hawaii off so this way Pearl Harbor will happen right now. Ah, we won. Good. And how long is it going to take? Not that long. Just... For the love of God, America, please do not come out. Do not worry about it. Okay. Manchuria, Manchuria cordial. Huh. War between Japan and Hawaii. Fears of Greece. I am our best friend. Our best friend. Come on, give me the Hawaiian Islands. Ah, yay! Look at that. Uh, please. Thank you. I got Hawaii! Look at that! Ah, our own colony, and we can sphere a little bit or influence our relations to Persia, which gives us access to the goods, which I know they don't have that many goods, but I don't want to, like, sphere anyone really close by me, just because I don't want to help them out too much, help them westernize, and stuff like that. Uh, do you actually have a port here? No, you don't. Uh, they got quite a bit of resistance. I need to leave, like, a token garrison here or something. So, you know what we're going to do? We're going to come there. Once I get on here, I'm going to set these guys over here to help, like, keep resistance down here. Oh, come on, Russia. What you... You're not. Wait, oh, well, hold on. Oh, the Chinese Empire. No wonder America can do that. They lost their allies or something, did they? No. No way. You not? Oh, hell yeah. Help me take down the other Chinese people? Yeah, please. Thank you. Good, so come on down here. And we're actually going to go to Api, Api, and then trade... Uh, these guys out. Because I don't mind leaving you guys there to help garrison Hawaii. Uh, maybe, maybe not. I need more divisions over here. Mm. We do have another small task force. How's that navy coming along? We're building stuff. We're building stuff eventually. That's good. And we still have two more ships here. Albania. Inter oh my god. An international crisis. We're not really... A backing of... Uh, no. I don't, I don't want to... You Europeans, go kill each other. All right. Japan is... Okay, never mind. Al <laughs> Albania's here. What the heck? <laughs> oh my goodness. This is a weird world. Actually. Uh, that's... Well, I need to really lower our infamy limit. I'm going to wait quite a while before I go to war. I'll probably go to war with China again. Just because... Actually, how... We have a truce until 1857. That's five-ish years. I did say I want to go to Oman. How much infamy would that cost me? Demand gets five. Uh, I mean, I, I know you can lower infamy by releasing states and stuff. I'm not really interested in that too much. Yunnan. You know what? I think Yunnan might be a good ally. So, you know what? I'm going to do this as well. Just because we might be able to boost them up. They can come to our aid if we need help them out or something. Uh, stockpile the tea. That'd be great. Great. Persia. And I do want to take as much as I possibly can. Eh, you know what? Laos. Dai Nam. They're only allied to Guangxi, Cambodia, Burma. I think Burma usually gets taken up by the UK, so I don't want to get involved with them. I really don't want to get involved with them. Uh, make sure we keep good relations with these guys. Good relations. Good relations. Screw the Russians. Thank you. Thank you. I don't know who's going to be, like, really powerful by the end of this, so that's why I'm doing it like that. 
you guys come here. Good. I'm going to send you back to Japan, where I want to trade you with Nagasaki. Good, good, good. Some more ships coming out. Just gotta wait a little bit of time to lower our influence of those guys. Good. And you got people come back to Saigon. So that we have enough resistance. You guys are doing okay over there. Um, I don't mind you doing this. I'm going to send you guys down here. I'm going to cut you guys in half. Because half you guys are just going to go bye-bye so we can make more infantry or artillery divisions. Brigades, 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 yeah. Cool, you guys need artillery. So we need one horse, four... Uh, one horse... No, uh, yeah, one horse, four artillery. That's too much infantry, hold on. That's too much. Uh, that's okay for now. One horse, four artillery. One, two, three, four, one. Horse. Even though cavalry isn't great, hussars I think are better. Whatever. Um, uh, yeah. You guys come down there. There you go. So we got you guys dropped off. <gasps> oh, look at that! Very nice. It helps us with our military. Great industry. I want to do more stuff. Positivism. Let's get some more education going. We need super high research rates. Prestige is going up. That's awesome, awesome, awesome. 14. Mm, you guys will be good down here. That's awesome. You guys are down here. I might send... Hmm. Just thinking... Because I, I still want to garrison Hawaii. I mean, you never know there's going to be rebellions. And I don't really want to be bothered with rebellions that much. So. And they're back. Great. Welcome back. Let's see. Any place else I can expand railroads or anything like that. Because we got money now. We got a lot of money. This is awesome. Uh, you know what? Lower it. We're doing so well. I feel good enough to do something like this. Lower our supplies. Make a little bit more money. Maybe lower our tariffs a little bit as well. Make our people a little bit more rich that way. Stockpile extra tea. Persia. Thank you, my friend. Yeah, I definitely want to go to Oman or something. Actually, do I have a... Can I go to war with you? Oh, we're too nice with each other. No. No niceness. No niceness. Oh, look. There's another 30 stack. Great. And since you're here, I'm going to drop you off. we got two here. We've got one here. Put you back in Hawaii because of rebels. This is probably not a good idea to do, but that's okay. Foul murder. Japan is in a state of collective shock. As news broke today of a foul murder committed in one of our states. A young girl working as a prostitute. Ooh. And the state was found brutally battered by a client. And rumor has it that the police are covering up the identity of the murderer. Who, it has been claimed, belongs to a rich banking family of some local renown. Police, however, maintain that they are still investigating the matter, but that no perpetrator has yet been located. The affair is on everyone's lips, and the debate has even reached Parliament, where the Liberal MPs demand answers from the government regarding the matter. I need to slip a copy for this. Oh my goodness. Let us not throw allegations wildly about. You know, whatever. I feel for the prostitute, but, you know, you shouldn't be being your prostitutes like that. There's other ways. Anyways, um, anyway, yeah. Oh, we went down to eight. Oh, I don't like that. I really don't like that. We need to make more divisions. Brigades, brigades. I played too much Hoi 4. I played way too much Hoi 4. So, uh, you don't come here, because we need five artillery pieces. Actually, can we get that straight from Korea? That actually might be more... No, we can't. Oh, God. Uh, artillery. And I will be justifying soon on Omen. There you go. Let's go ahead and justify, since why not? Because I want to get to Egypt, and you want to take the Suez just for funsies. Uh, Ottomans, why? Why would you do that? You took Transjordan, but you didn't take Egyptian hail? What the heck? <laughs> oh my goodness, actually, what do you... Oh, you're allied with Ethiopia and Hejaz. Uh, Omen is easier to get. They're allied with Abu Dhabi. Actually, would Abu Dhabi be better? Because something tells me they're going to have a lot of... Good resources here later on. Omen. Oh, they got... <gasps> we can get opium. Ooh, opium. I love opium. I have no idea if that does anything for us. Let's, let's check the world market. Does opium do anything good? Well, the Chinese might say no, but I'm not Chinese here. 
Oh, look at that. Oh, but you want really want more of that. It's con it's a consumer good. Oh, what's in it? It's been getting kind of high. It's probably kind of worthless, honestly. But screw it, we're gonna do it. Give me your bodies. I mean your opium. Yeah, yeah, good enough, close enough. Where did I send my guys? I forget. Shippies. Oh, they went to Hawaii. That's right. Well, taking the beaches, guys. It's a nice place. I've only been there once, I think. Oh, and we don't want to forget population. So we got whoa, oh, four percent clergymen that are wowzers. Bro, so from Kanto, bring on the clergymen. And in Kyushu, we have four. Oh wow, we're pretty good. Four percent there too. Uh, Tohoku, Tohoku. Yeah, I get some clergymen from Kyushu. Very cool. Our population overall is still 70% Japanese, 23% uh, Korean, quite a little, a little chunk of uh, Vietnamese people here, that's okay. Very nice, the Omani Menace, yes, quite the menace. And you know what, oh, how many more ships do we need? We want, we're trying to make one more Man of War, that's cool, that's great. You know what, expand factories, because I want... I, it's not a good idea probably to expand too early. It really isn't. But that's okay. That's totally okay. I could just like subsidize my factories, but I'm not doing that. That was flipping fast. So on January 19th, 1854, we can take more stuff from them. Uh, if that's the case, I, I'm just going to send one of these guys down here first. That'd be fine. So, yeah. So in December of 1854, we should go to war. We get more education efficiency. Great. Let's get even more. I want a ton. And then we're going to start doing more with our army. And maybe a little bit more of our navy. Because we don't want to lack behind in the navy whatsoever. That's important. Good, 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 good. Awesome. Uh, you know what? You guys just combine down here. Plenty of frigates. Like I said, I really don't... Oh, so these are light ships. Six frigates. Heavy ships. Two heavy ships. I really don't know the composition that you should really use for these guys, so we're kind of just kind of basing it off of pretty numbers. What is this? Access. Demand concessions. Yeah. Are you fighting somebody? Oh, you're fighting. Oh, you're fighting other Chinese states. Qinghai. Mongolia. You look really large. Oh, you're in the... Ru oh, I don't like that. I don't like that you're in the Russian sphere. So Manchuria is allied with Mongolia. You guys are fighting Qinghai. King Hai and Xinjiang. Well, that makes sense. The Chinese don't like this group. Holy crap, they're taking them out like crazy. Yeah, we focus more on our army tech. That's my goal. Oh, good. More delegated power. A lot more army tech because I'm going to go strike into China. Uh, probably here first. Or maybe. Uh... Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Who? Hold on. Oh, the Chinese Empire owns that. I did not realize that. Sorry. I'm still a little bit of a noob at this game. So, it is what it is. Alright, let's get ready to go into war. Send you guys on a boat. Raise our level of supplies and stuff like that. Alright guys, to Oman. And December we go. We got a good old Admiral here. He's, no, he's not good at attack. And let's go to war. Allied with Abu Dhabi? No one cares. Oh, we only can demand concessions, so we can't annex them. You know, whatever. It'd be what it'd be. What do we want? Kenya, Zanzibar, or Somaliland? Somaliland, Zanzibar, Kenya. Now, I wanted to take them out, but we would probably do conquest stuff. Now, I don't want to get involved with the Portuguese, because the Portuguese, they probably want Zanzibar. It's pro is it worth taking Somaliland? I kind of wanted their stuff, but whatever. Mm, Zanzibar. Where's Kenya? Is that is this Kenya? Oh, that's that's so little. Somaliland might be better. They have a Western presence. That's only Mogadishu. Sixty-one thousand people. Twenty-six. Kenya's Kenya's not really worth it. It's only one state. Zanzibar sounds like fun, but the Portuguese might take that, and it's not really worth fighting the Portuguese. I might as well just take uh, Somaliland. It's not much. It's really almost nothing. But that gives us direct access to colonize Somaliland when it becomes available. So I'm actually okay with that. So let's go ahead and go to war. It's only one state. Five infamy honestly really wasn't worth it. That was my bad. But you know what? I'm still learning this game. Whatever. Ah, uh, good. Conservatives go down. I want more liberal presence to get more reforms. 
because let's see politics I want to get better health care eventually we gotta do political reforms first to get more press rights more you know literacy that'd be good having a literate population is probably a little bit helpful not gonna lie well since you're here you, uh, it's nine divisions but you guys are pretty good so good go ahead and come up that way guys Straits of Hormuz Oh, where'd you go? I will kill you. Oh, well. Cool. That was fast. Come down there, please. Thank you. And we have Mogadishu. Very cool. Not really worth much at all. Probably wasn't even worth taking. So, I'm going to drop these guys off here. And that actually is a good landing port to go to get to Egypt, too. That's pretty cool. So, oh, look at that. More defense. I love it. Um, Can I... You can't really train anyone there. Take these guys. You know what? If I just leave you there, that might be okay. Because I need this army still. Come back down here to Saigon. Let's go to figure out how to go to war with China. That's a lot of guys. That is a lot of guys. Um, you're primitives. Honestly, striking through Manchuria first might be better. Because then we can just take Manch Manchu Manchuria to get to the North Zili. Just have a land, you know land province that way. That might be... Oh, we like him too much. God dang it. Oh, yeah. We want to improve relations once again. Yeah, definitely don't go over those guys. You know what? Improve relations with those fellas. Democracy, you guys. And, like I say, screw the Russians. Oh, look at that. Nine ships. Now, that might be a good composition. That might not be. I have no idea. Let's go ahead and justify on these fellas when we can. Or... Yeah, it's just best to wait. Oh, let's go to war with these guys. Do we have a, still have a truce with them? Yes, we do. But do we have a truce with Manchuria? No, we don't. So we gotta wait a little bit to go to war. I can... I can conquest? Oh my god. That'd be amazing. Freaking demand concession for declaring war. 139 days. I could free people. I can make them my puppet. That'd be fun. Uh, but I know puppets can break free if they become great powers themselves, so I don't exactly want to do that. Conquest sounds amazing. I get all of this territory early on. Oh my god, that sounds really rebellious. That sounds like fun, though. The Chinese Empire looks disgusting. Hmm, how much does it cost for me to demand consent? It's only 5 versus 22. That's a big bite. I'm probably just going to demand concession. Probably, unless... Yeah, concession. Yeah, I'm probably gonna just demand concession. Just because I know Russia... Okay, so here's the thing. The reason I'm doing that is because... When I played as Qing China and Kaiserreich in Hoi 4, people were upset, some people were, that I took this area of Outer Manchuria, which they, people didn't realize that actually China owned this for, like, a long time. So, as much as I would like this, I know Russia has an event that gives them this from anyone that's China, don't really want to get involved at the moment with them. Don't really. Eventually, of course. Look at all that money. Jesus, that's amazing. Ugh. Cool, and our guys are coming back. Drop them off, and head on out again. South Korean Sea. Yeah, that's really the South Japanese Sea. Wait, what? See, exactly. This is exactly what I was talking about. This was this would happen. And now they're in the... God dang sphere. Well, at least we weren't caught doing that. Yeah, that looks really disgusting. That looks really disgusting now. Hmm. I don't like that they're in the Russian sphere. I, I'm definitely not ready for a war with Russia. As, you know, Russia isn't super strong. But I can't fight France and then the Netherlands and Krakow. Well, I can fight Krakow and Albania, but... So be it. To war with China, then. Oh, we need more temple points. God dang it. And independent command, cool. Justify war, demand concessions. It's only five infamy. That's fine. Great. Ooh, buy a lot. Ooh, hold on. I like that. We don't get in this. Oh, we should be able to. Oh, but we need more research points. I definitely have to do this. I have to get to there, but armies. Oh, god dang it. Uh, let's do this next. And then military staff systems. 
Uh, this is the case. You guys come over here. And I'm only building up these factories more just so that uh, we get higher... Mostly just so that we get higher industrial score, because we're only 11. Which is okay. It's not great. You guys come up there. Uh, who's next? You guys are okay. Well, you guys, some guys are lacking a little bit. Give me half of you guys. Goodbye. You're next. And we need five. Actually, before we do that, check out Korea. They cannot hold it anymore. That's okay. Build five more things of Japanese artillery. Two, three, five. There we go. I might create another Vietnamese army too. Baking convention? Yeah. Manchuria? Makes sense. Alright. Very good, very good, very good. Now, I definitely want you guys like over here. Chinese menace, they're coming straight for us. Yes, they are. In which I'm going to invade Port Arthur first, and then take way high w away. Oh, we got you. Hold on, let's see. If we invade, look at Lies Hu. Oh, there we go. We can go to war immediately. Uh, oh, we still have. I forgot to lower my army maintenance stuff. Uh, before we do anything else, can we build railroads, ports? Anything here? It's kind of mountainous there, yeah. Makes sense. Mogadishu. Ethiopia is kicking some Egyptian booty. Holy cow. India's a mess, but that's pretty normal. Anything down here? Nope. Doesn't look like it. We got garrisons everywhere, which I love, 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 love. Hmm. But I also love coffee. So. How did I get 17? Oh, the Russians are there too. So, to do this, I'm going to send you guys here to hang out for now. We're going to need more divisions. Oh, we're definitely going to need more armies for this. They're going to dogpile way too many guys. Uh, everyone come down south. Alright, so you guys should be good. Give me U9. And anyone who comes up that way, we're going to cut off. Very good. And... Oh, what is this? Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want... Manchuria. Chinese Manchuria. Shandong might be good. Actually, that might be really good to take. Yunnan looking pretty good. So what can we take from these guys? Oh, we can take so much. Sichuan, Henan, Hong Kong. Okay, that's cool. Chinese Manchuria. Actually, what's in Chinese Manchuria before we do anything? Is there anything good? They got timber. Cotton, which is okay. This is a ton of population. Oh, not there, though. A million people in that group... Uh, I've been told that it's better to get down here, too. For most, this sounds like fun. Hmm. I kind of want Shandong. But actually, coming down here, actually, you know what? I might take this region first. I know I'm taking a while to do this. Let's go with regions. Uh, taking this actually might be better... Just because... Oh, hold on. No, 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 no. We've got to see China explode with the Heavenly Kingdom first. That's right. Oh, just because I could expand into Guangxi as well, which would be great, because then we can get closer and closer to our ally in Yunnan. Let's just take Shandong first. Make it easy on us. Shandong. Give me your dong. Thank you. Great. Great. I'm a little worried, because they're going to death stack stuff, because China, you know, they death stackers. Come on. Good. Immediately do that. You guys come in and get Qingdao. We can do that. That'd be amazing. You guys come down here to Qingzhou. Oh, oh boy. I should have guarded this a little bit better. Uh, that's not good. Mm, I don't like that. I really don't like that. Can we build any more military stuff here? How many? If that's the case, so be it. War score probably isn't that high yet. Eight, ah, 8%, eight it's not bad. It's not bad so far. Oh, hold on. 
hundreds of guys. Can you both just pull out for now? Yeah, they pull. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's so many guys. Oh, I was not ready for this. Oh my god, we're winning now. Oh my, it's 16,000 versus 160,000. Jesus Christ. Can I, can I piece, I can piece him out already. Oh yeah, just, just do that, yeah. Oh, holy crud. That's insane. That's insane. That was amazing though. Oh my goodness, I'm happy about that. Yeah, I forgot. Yeah, they, they can just death stack. Oh my god. Holy crud. Ching Dao, you're going to get a naval base and build forts everywhere here. Uh, I definitely want more infrastructure, though. Oh. Uh, that was insane. Fighting China is just... Oh my god. I don't, I don't even know. You're going to put one guy there. You're going to put one guy there to help stack the border. We're going to need a lot of armies down here. I'm going to need more armies in general. You guys, come down here, please. Thank you very much. We need three artillery pieces for this area. Uh, yep, the American fear. Chile relations with the UK. Interesting. Japan, of course, expands. And I was researching this stuff for a war with Japan, but or China, I mean. Hold on, breach. Oh, that's good. We need we need colonial negotiations. Oh, there's so much I want to do though. I need more of uh, education efficiency plus 50%. I need more research points. Uh, I feel like I'm just trying to catch up to everyone else in the game. Go ahead and do that. Whatever. So much money. Actually, it's... Can we war with these guys? They're allied. They're, they have Cambodia, Guangxi, and Burma. I feel like I'm stretching myself out just a little bit too much right now. We need more artillery. Go to trade artillery. Uh, there you go. That's what you want. Right, you guys are looking pretty good. Come on down. Just there. Yeah, that'd be good. What's going on over here? Included Kiva. All right, whatever. John Brown's last raid. Well, it sounds like they're gearing up for a little expansion. Oh, God, America. Why did you take that? Oh, hello. That was a fast con Confederate States of America. You, don't, you didn't even get all of Texas. You got... No, yeah, you did get Kentucky. That's pretty good. You didn't get Missouri, which makes sense. But why not all of Texas? I guess there's not a lot of Dixie culture here. That makes some sense, actually. Darn it, you didn't expand, like, slavery? Come on, man. Oh, they're already at war. This is an early second second civil war. No, this is the first civil war. I think. That's beautiful. Well, some people, I'd say that. Uh, are you fighting somebody? Oh, yeah, yeah, kill off the Russians if you can, yeah, yeah. Go right on ahead, guys. Go right on ahead. Kill off those Russians if you can. Ambassador insulted to Spain? You know what? I like prestige. Let us send an official letter thanking them for their time and end the negotiations between us. It makes us look better, so... Hmm, screw you, Spain. You look like a bunch of dribbly people. Like a... Uh, uh Spain. Spain, Spain, Spain. Keep building this up, even if it's not profitable. Yes. Uh, no. I do not want Russia to win. So you're not allowed in Russia. Sorry. Not really sorry, though. Good. Build this up. We have plenty of money. You know what? I'm going to lower my tax rate on capitalists or the upper class so they build more. We don't want money from you. Even though buying more stuff here would be good. Oh, we got more budget. Hold on. Diplomacy. Diplomacy. Yeah, the Confederates are not going to win. It's really hard playing as the Confederates, I found. This makes it sen some sense, you know. Oh, Spain. Oh, the Ottomans are no longer great power. Spain is, though, for now. Good, 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 good. Let's see, we got four. We need, we need a horse. Horsey. <gasps> oh, engineers. I like engineers. Please do not let... Ru oh, Russia's winning. God dang it. I really don't like that. Grievous insults. Cut down to size on Siam. Siam? Are you Okay. Yunnan, Luobang, arms, war reparations, forced disarmament. Oh, Siam, you did not want to do that. No, 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 my boy. Actually, how fast can we build this guy up? Because we have until October of next year. So really, in September, we should go to war with them. Because I want another horse and send these guys out. Mobilization, organization, and then I'm going to build up another army here in Japan. 
Dark Velveteen. Ooh, that does not look good. Administrative stuff is okay. Uh, lower this by a little bit. You can probably do that for now. Lower that by a little bit as well. Make a little bit more money. Army speed, good, 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 good. Down here. Yes, I am. Great, gas him. Good, get down here. And we're gonna need three more artillery pieces here. No one in Korea can supply that. Actually, I might take some Chinese. Oh, I'm gonna leave the Chinese there for now. Let's go to make some artillery pieces to go on that army. One, two. And then we'll have a home island resistance kind of group. Supplies going up, which is kind of nice. Good. Actually, I guess send you guys right there. If I can take something. Uh, war reparations sound like fun. They're uncivilized. Ugh. Uncivilized folk. It's honestly probably not worth going to war, but that's okay. And time for war again. Because we can get money. I like money. Give them another month so I guys get a little bit more experience or something. East Macedonia. No, thank you. Cool. France has backed them up. Well, don't ask me. I'm going to go to war. My own war. Cut time down to size. Half of the armed forces limits protected by Yunnan, our ally. Will Yunnan join us? They will not accept. So be it. They chose this. Don't ask me. Don't tell me this. Go straight for that group. Ah, so they want to fight me, I see. How do they get to my lands, you see? I have no idea. Good, slaughter them. There's a oh the crisis, Ooh, yeah East Macedonia. Uh, oh Greece, hello. Oh man, look at that cultural pop. Ugh, oh, it's disgusting. Austria still here. Oh Austria, you're being up on some of them Germans, huh? Oh you're fighting the UK as well. That sucks. Ooh, we might not see a Germany form someday. I'm sure you know. Uh oh, hold on. Ah, you're doing better. The Chinese are taking out Manchuria. Yeah, let's hope so. Let us hope so. Great. Keep taking, sieging stuff down. I know you need engineers to siege stuff down better, but I don't know. Maybe we'll make an army for that eventually. Cultural stuff. Uh, give me give me another national focus. It's pretty quick to research that stuff. You guys have been great. Give me U9. Come up here. Nope. Oh, hello. Oh, they got rebels. Nice. Or at least it looks like they should. Hello. Oh, there they are. Found some rebels. They're reactionaries. Good. Phuket? Phuket. <laughs> Phuket. <laughs> ah, I love it. Give me your monies. Ah, rebels. Bunch of rebellions. What does this say? Oh, okay. So what happened here? What? No, no. That's disgusting. No. How did you lose, China? No. Russian. They literally cock blocked us from taking any more lands. No, 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 no. They have a massive army, though. And a lot of prestige. I'll let you guys come over here, too. I'll be fine. I don't know how much war score I need to take these guys out. Uh, you know what? You guys just stay there. You guys come over here. Nice. Blow up their ships. Rebels. Take care of your rebels for you. Can we peace out? Or do we have to go to your war leader? We need 50 war score. That's fine. And we gotta get to Luang Prabang. So be it. Oh, hello. I see you there. I see what you're doing. Let's see if we can get some military access. No, they don't. So be it. Blood and roses. More jingoism. Lose two war exhaustion. Ten percent more. Let's let's lose, let's lose some war exhaustion. That's good to do. Great. Um, come back here. Just in case they start moving. Good. We killed off quite a few of them. Let's come up there. You guys come this way, and we're gonna attack them. 
Let's see if this can do anything. Oh, we can't, because they have to move into our lands. Alright, so be it. You guys come right there. You guys come right there. Alright, they moved in. They have taken the bait. And crush them. Thank you. Thank you. They lost a 22,000 men. Oh, look at that. That's pretty good. Do they want PC yet? Hey, man, this is what Siam wanted. You know, you did this to me. Don't expect that we're going to be very nice to you. They will not accept. We need 3% more war score, which means we got to kill this guy off. Good. Come down here, my friend. Nice. That should do it for us. And, and Russia just broke their alliance with the Netherlands. That's why I don't ally the Russians. Propose peace. They will still not accept this, even though the war score is 52. Why would they not accept? We have won a total victory. Um, I can not negotiate with anyone. Oh, actually, you guys. Hmm. Siam. I can't negotiate with Siam, though, which kind of sucks. You know what? That's a good peace offer. And they accept it. What the heck? They said they wouldn't accept. Maybe my eyes are going crazy. But hey, we beat them. Do we get more prestige? We should get more prestige from that. So I'm going to send you guys down here. You guys are looking beautiful. You guys come down here. You guys come Saigon. Uh, you guys come to Saigon as well. Or just come over here. So that's where we're going to end today's episode. The Russians have been meddling in China, which makes it disgusting. Uh, let's see. Austria's getting... Whoa! They're getting destroyed by Italians. And Germans. But anyways, hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And tell me in the comments below, should I strike Ethiopia next? Or maybe I should finish off and take out more of Dynam. Anyways, thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day, my friends.